What up guys? It's your boy, Dirk. So today, we got some cool shit going on. We got... We got some cool shit going on today, so let's get this shit ready. Fuck! We got our essentials right here, so it's pretty dope. We got some buttons, some, some thing, and then a fucking case. So today we're going to be using this tool set, all this shit, gonna, gonna fucking use that for this shit, that right there fucking sucks so fuck that. So let's open this and let's see the switch, so move this to the side. The switch we're going to be working on is this great comes right here. It's nice, it's tight, it's, it looks great. So, you see, we got a, we got a nice case deal. So we're going to put this right here, slap it on right there. Now this isn't my first mod, I had done a lot of another mod. This is actually not my own console, this is somebody else's console. My switch looks so much better than this shit. So let's whip on my switch real quick. So this is my switch right here. As you can tell, This one is more superior, while this one is, eh. Now this one looks nice and dope, like a nice slick joysticks. Feel great, feel look, feel great. Now these are from Extreme Rate, they're pretty fucking dope when it comes to their fucking cases like this. This is good. I might have to replace that. You can see a little shimmer around there. But overall, this is a good deal. This is the guy that paid me. So his switch doesn't look that bad. Honestly, he just wants to switch out this shit right here. The fucking Joy-Cons and all that. Which, you know, I don't have an issue with it. Like, so let's see what we got. Bam. So, let's get the cases out. We're going to be using this shit. It's pretty good. It works really well. Fucking amazing. And then we're going to use our own toolkit, even though this comes already with a toolkit. For this shit, we're going to use this. Which, you know, freaking dope as shit. So, let's put those away. What the fuck am I doing with my life? Huh. We're not gonna be using this. You see that it comes with its own little thingy right here, right? Has a nice little knob twister and all that shit. So. From what I can tell. This is the left Joy-Con. So this let's put over here. And let's put this down over here. So let's let's work on this right here. This is the left joystick. You can clearly tell it's a left joystick for fuck's sake. I'm gonna put this and work. So, one of the things that you can point out right away is this right here, D-pad. Now, I never modded the switch to have a D-pad, so it's going to be interesting. And if you look over here, they have 
the black versions, but we're going to put this to the side because this man, this legend, he bought this right here. This nice, uh, he bought a white version of it, which is pretty dope. It looks great. So here's the black keys, and then here's the the generic extreme rate, you know. It's kind of dope. It looks pretty dope. So, I'm going to open the entire package. I'm going to put this over here, save it for later. Who knows, maybe I want to make my own uh, little D-pad switch. So, all this, working with all of this right here. So, let's get, let's get down and boogie, you know. So, first of all, let's see this. This is an extreme rate um, shit right here. So we got our generic little screw thing over here. We got another one, so let's see how many we can pile those up. Shit, this is crazy. By the way, guys, I'm kind of nervous because this isn't my own switch. This is like somebody's paying me $25, $35, whatever the fuck, to mod their fucking switch, so... You know, it. Uh. Huh. So you can tell these are. They feel good. They, they feel really good. It's just weird to see how. This is going in here, which, not gonna lie, that looks fucking dope. But, like, we're missing. Yeah, we're missing a, a few buttons in here. So, first of all, we're missing this right here. Like, this isn't in here. But what we do have is the, the side buttons, so... Let's just break these off real quick. Not gonna lie, these buttons are not my kind of thing. White buttons is like really like it depends on like what kind of person you are. So let's pick out the buttons that we actually need. So if left, so if right, and then so this is for. And you know what? I just realized this is going to be super easy because we only got to worry about this and then this, the left and right triggers, so. All of this, fuck it. Put that over here. And so... All we're going to be working with right now is the left side and all the right side parts and shit are going over there. So we got this, this to replace. We also got these white little things that we have to replace from here, which I never done. Like, the only thing I've ever done is replace this, so that's gonna be a little fun. And we got a little, we got a little packet of shit right here. So let's go ahead and uh, open this bad up, bad bitch up. So 
Let's whip these out. These are extra uh, thing. You can just reuse the thing that's in here already. So I wouldn't I wouldn't waste those screws like for that. So so here we got we got a. Uh, Okay, so we have the Y, the Y thing, and then the plus. Honestly, I don't know what the fuck they're called. I am literally... Go ahead and do this shit real quick. Ooh. Shit, nice and cool. So, for a fact, you're going to start with the Y tip. So, we're going to put this here and here. This little thing in my jig. This is literally the bare minimum shit you need. All you need is this. So you're gonna see there's this right here. One. And you just wanna take it in there. Nice little stack of it. Be careful with your switch, your little thingies. Damn. This one being a pain in the ass. So we took out the screws right here, got a nice, even little shit right there. So I'm pretty sure you want a little, little tear up right here, go all the way around. Issue with these Joy-Cons. need to be careful when you open it yeah Hold up. I usually uh. Uh. A little tiny nib doesn't hurt Oh god, it looks complicated. Oh shit, we got some fucking dinky dukes in here. So, let's see. Oh shit, you know what? Since I have two of these, I can use this one as the plus side, so. I recommend removing this little dinky thing right here. This that dinky thing right there that is the battery and it stinks so battery all you want to do is like calmly come in here it has a little bit of resistance but eh, bam take it out I recommend using plastic plastic is the way to go and then there's a little little adapter right there. If you notice, there's a little adapter right there. That's what's giving power to the whole thing. You don't want that plugged in while you're working on the 
the little joy con so I recommend you take your little thinky thing and you pull it up now these are sensitive see the little dinky things these are batteries so fucking be careful with them for fuck's sakes and we can already put this shit in here bam look at that this is a black version of it so it's gonna look dope as shit so I, I, I genuinely don't want to put these white things because they look they're gonna look bad like this guy doesn't understand that his shit doesn't work as like a, as a unit because some of the stuff doesn't work and some of the stuff like it's gonna fit so now we're gonna start using is this the triangle I can't tell yeah this is a triangle so let's put triangle like that so let's get god fucking damn it these fucking screws suck ass bro I guess he tightened them I guess that's how it works I don't know so let's get these screws right here mind you these fucking these fucking screwdrivers sucks to work on these like these fucking they don't fucking hold as much as you wish you want them to and they really are annoying like look at this shit I don't stand these fucking these are like the cheapest screwdrivers they can give you but that's good because some people are fucking dumb and they don't have this kind of shit so might as well give them something that they can work with right like let me figure out what the fuck is this because I'm, the more I'm staring at the more I'm confused I am like what the fuck is this Okay, so that's it going in. But then what the fuck is this screwing part doing? Like, Okay, there we go. And there's one, two, and then one right here. You want to take out. So those are the three main switches. And then you could, like, take this off nicely. I recommend... You look for this right here. So what you want to do is lift up that little tiny piece. Bam. It's a little black piece that you want to lift up, like flick it up. And it's going to be really nice. And then let's whip out the tweezers. And then Lick this out, bam. Oh look, that fucking thing came out. Wonderful. So. Take the spring out. And replace the fucking father of the spring with this thing. There, bam. So now we have this. Oh, 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 God. There it is. There it goes. This is a fucking disaster. So let's leave that there. Leave that there. Holy fucking shit. So. I'm realizing a few things, so we gotta disconnect this. So. <laughs> Creeper. Aw, oh, man. It's literally my fucking. And then. Bam. Look at that! We, we're progress! Okay, so... 
right off the bat, what you could do is like this little piece right here. This little piece right here. I'll connect in here and there you go. This don't need it. Don't need it. We don't need it. Actually, we don't need it. <laughs> Fuck! So these screws right here, I'm actually genuinely scared I'm gonna lose them. I'm trying to do a gag where I just leave them there, but I'm genuinely scared I'm gonna lose them, so. Get them nice. Nice, tight, and little. Little stack right there. Like, yeah. Little happy family. Separation. Equality. So. My next step, I would say, is let's switch out these buttons right here. These, they kind of, they kind of stand out to me. So let's grab little black things right here. Grab this right here. Or if you want, let's use this for example, since some people are not going to have that right there. So you grab here and you flick it up and... Grab the hard part of it, bam. That's one. And let's see how this works. So, this one you want to move the black part, and this one you want to move the gray part. The great part is the thing that's holding it back. So there we go. Save that for later. <laughs> so let's see. So we got this one in and this one in that we gotta switch out. So we got it here, and then we got this here. So how do we do that? I actually don't know. I haven't done this part. I haven't removed this, so apparently we're gonna remove this. And we're gonna put this back together quick, so let's put that over there. And wow, that was easy. So we only have these two parts. You can see like there's a black button right there, so There's this weird plastic thingy. I'm assuming you put it in here. By the way, I'm not watching a tutorial or anything. I'm literally just doing this from memory of doing the, the wood switch Joy-Cons, you know? The, the weird ones. Anyway, so we get to stick this in here. And bam! We got the things done. So, let me see this. So, so slash right left right mm. gonna be left right or not it's gonna be upside down so I'm genuinely confused right now because this is like the first time I've done something like this so So remember our earlier Joy-Con, we had the left and right. So we're going to look at this again. We're going to look at that to the side as like that. Left, right. So pointing that way. So right is going to be here. Bam. Then.
That's an enemy over here. Oh shit, they... I didn't realize this until now. So, some buttons have like these little grooves on them. This actually has the grooves already. This one has the, the right grooves and this one has the left grooves. So, it just fits no matter what you do, so. That's dope. Now, I forgot how I stuck this on. Okay, so this is going like that. No, like... It's like the most stressful thing. I'm like genuinely shaking from this shit. Like, fuck, man. Holy fucking shit. I know I'm not doing anything crazy, but still, like... Now that, I'm not gonna lie. That looks dope. That actually looks dope, so... Let's get rid of these and put them... Voila. So what we want to do is stick it right... Here. Like, stick it like that. But not on here. I want to stick it on here. Right? No. It's here. Because this goes right there. Ah, here we go. Like right there. This is where you want to stick it. So. Let's stick this button back to its place right here. Stick it right here. I'm like genuinely fucking nervous because I've like never done like this such a big of a mod to a console and like I'm genuinely scared I'm gonna break this shit. Like I know like when, when I went to the dude I was like acting super confident I'm like yeah I'll get it done by like tomorrow morning and I, I did not realize how much this takes. So. There we go. Nice and good. Little, little thank you. So, what do we want to do? So, we are going to take this right here. We're going to transport everything that's in here onto here. Now, this may look a little bit difficult, but we have the button right there, and we got the switch right here, so first of all, take out the springs. I highly recommend you take out the springs. These fucking springs are the end of my misery, so uh, so let's By the way, we're going to break this off, so get them in here, then crank that boy open, like right there, and then crank it open. Get, get the fucking in! Get in! Bam. And then, god damn it. I'm going to crank that soldier boy, you know? God, this is so fucking stressful. Okay, there we go. We, we got the... You know, that's like an issue that I noticed. Is like, like, we haven't got that much analog controllers lately. Analog controllers are so much fun to mess with. This is just a fucking button. There's no... Like, the spring is literally just to push it back up. So, we're going to leave that right there. And there we go. The uh, new shelf. Bam. I'll buy that for a thousand dollars. Okay. 
So we gotta make sure that this lines up with itself again. So bam, stick it in there. That's what she said. And then we're gonna get a little, 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 little Nelly, little, little Nelly, little, little Jimmy, little, 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 little Timmy. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. I am like so fucking nervous right now. I'm not even fucking joking. Like, like I. So my original Joy Cons I modded, I broke like a charging the battery port so like the whole thing was fucked not like the battery itself but like the the port like the the thing where you plug the battery in and it completely fucked everything so I'm interested to see how this is going to work because like I'm imagining it's not going to be a good d-pad because doesn't have the ballpoint right there, but we'll see how it is. Um, right, this. So this is a, this is the fucking worst part. So right here, on this little dinky little thing, there's a there's like pins. I'm trying to find the optimal light. There's like pins where you want to put the spring in. So when you when you when you twist it in onto here it fucking bounces everywhere and it's fucking dog ass so you know fucking be careful with this shit this is like genuinely horrifying to me so oh my god this is so fucking scary so you wanna just get it in get it in as soon as you fucking can because once you get it in that's when that's when Obama becomes president again okay so two issues this fucking spring sucks and I've been recording for like 30 minutes so this is, this is fucking cancer. What the fuck? So, first of all, that feels good, but this spring right here is wrong. So, I gotta open it. And, like, this is my first mod, by the way. Like, I was. Like, I wish my shit wasn't as complicated as fucking other people's shit, but, you know, like, when I say it's my first mod, I mean, like, this mod that's, like, so fucking crazy to me, like, I really want to build, like, a fucking Game Boy, like, advanced Game Boy, that'd be dope as shit, like, a Game Boy that can, like, have rich colors and shit, screen that doesn't look like ass. In a fucking case that's not like dog cancer. First try! First try! Fight me, motherfuckers. So, there we go. First try. Been recording for like a whole fucking 30 minutes just to get this fucking far. 
Well, overall, I'm pretty happy. So, we got this, we got this. Now onto this shit. So let's put this over here. This is where shit gets real. So, first of all, let's remove this. So we're gonna put this in here. Yeah, let's just do that. So I recommend using tweezers and grabbing the side of the thing. Not to say that this thing is sensitive, it's just... It sucks, so... Oh... Oh, I broke it. I'm just kidding, I didn't break it. You could leave it in there, I recommend you take it out still. But... For the sake of like not wanting to break it, because I'm scared that I'm gonna break, I'm gonna leave it in there. It's just like more like if you think it's quicker or not. So let's remove that over there, and then what the fuck is this? Is this black latch or gray latch? Okay, so everything that's black. Or gray are the things that you want to move. I say gray is very important and like black is medium and then white you don't even want to fucking yank it out. Like white is not necessary but black and gray is very necessary. I had some Hawaiian pizza so my, my thing smells like shit now. So, let's remove this little thing in here. Fun fact, you know, like, just to prevent people from meddling with their shit, Nintendo does this thing where the... Okay, so that's connected to this. Nintendo makes it harder to go from the inside. Like, the outside screws are, like like are this fucking triangle which is hard to get because like a plus screwdriver it's super easy to find that shit but like 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 those fucking triangle motherfuckers fuck no nah. so these screws are about the same size I hate the fucking magnets the fucking magnets are pissing me off like I just want to drop you right there. I don't care. So there we have our little dinky dinky dungu. So let's remove this little thing right here. So this is going to be weird because some of the buttons are going to be black and some of the buttons are going to be gray and shit. So that's the first instance where... That shit is just not going to work in or anything. So we want to put that in there. I'm like genuinely scared so let's leave that in there for now so let's take everything else out everything is color coded by the way so silver are the shortest gold is like medium and then like they really thought out the design of this fucking joy con like they really had to so something is preventing me to pull this shit out so there's the little dinky thing <sighs> now this one is a little dirty a little dirty in the inside right here so the guy that owned this switch has probably owned this switch for a very long time and this little dinky thing is just fucking good it feels nice in the hand as well it's not like annoying so, I honestly don't know what the fucking point of this thing right here is. Like, 
I, I guess they prevent the thing from like rotating to scratch it, but it's really not necessary. It's like, it's like one of those things you stare at and you're just like, why the fuck do you exist? And then it starts fucking crying and it starts fucking regretting life to see. Now the rumble pack, they have it nice glued in. So if this was my Joy Cons, I would definitely glue it in. But since it's not, we're just gonna we're just gonna let those slide, you know? Like I'm not trying to be an asshole or anything, it's just I'm not I'm doing this for fucking twenty five dollar guy. Bam. And it's still sticky, so it might actually just work. So There's a little screw right there. I completely forgot about this screw right here. By the way, the left and right Joy-Cons are like so different, but like... You expect them to be different, but they're different for like completely di Oh! Oh shit! I see what they did! So, they got this little plus thing in the middle. That's where it holds into this. Motherfucker, no. Look at that. That's dope. So, wow, wow. That's gonna be feeling so weird. So all of this, we kinda don't need, so. Wait, I don't know what this guy was thinking in his head when he ordered this kind of stuff, because like, to me, it kind of like it's a mix mash of like shit that's not gonna look good to with each other. Like, for example, the D pad. The D pad. I honestly hope, wonder what the fuck this D pad is gonna feel like. Like, this D pad is. So fucking weird to me like the concept of having a d-pad on a joy-con is weird even though I know in this the the switch light that's what the, exactly what they fucking did they made like oh god I forgot where the fuck these screws go shit well there's only one way to find out so let's grab one of these tiny screws Put them right there. Oh my god. I Feels weird as fuck, like... Like, I'm not trying to diss on the guy, but, like, that just feels weird. Like, really weird. I'll probably get this Joy-Con and, like, misshapen it so I can put that there. Or, nah. Yeah, that's not going to work. Okay, so, change of plan. Leave it like that. So let's grab this little black thingy right here, which I, I still don't know what the fuck this thing is for. Physically or mentally, what the fuck is the purpose of this? So the coloring of this thing is going to be all over the place because we got black stuff, white stuff, and red stuff. And the black and like I... I'm like, my inner design is like yelling at me like, don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do it. It's literally like yelling in my head like, stop. Stop what you're doing. So, that goes there. 
That looks kind of dope. Holy shit, like... So, there we go. So this guy has this weird thing where like the Joy-Cons, like they feel clicky when you rotate it. I purposely uh, switch my shit. It feels feel clicky, but not as bad as this. Like when I mean clicky, you feel like a little chunk, like a ching chang chunk, like kind of vibe when you turn it around. So once we got this connected, let's like get all this wired up. So first of all, let's get the joystick all wired up. What you want to do is stick it in there. Just go. And there we go. We connected it. There. It works. <laughs> there. I know I've been quiet as shit and, and all that, but like this is genuinely stressful. So. <sighs> okay, so we have these button connected, which is pretty good. Now we just have to put the R, and then on top of this, we're going to put this part, bam, and that's for done with the, oh god. Like, I fucking hate this fucking phone. Anyway. Okay, we're back. Holy fucking shit, that took way too long. Alright. So, my camera just froze a little bit, sorry. So, let's get this shit rolling. So, last thing I put it on was this little thing, right? So, let's connect this onto here, and that should be good, right? Hopefully. I hope so. Jesus, fuck, I don't want to think about that. Uh... I'm thinking these uses the long screws. I'm not sure. Like, I haven't touched this in a while, so. Mind if I experiment? 
No, this goes the tiny screws. And the tiny screws are right here. Bam. Ate some Hawaiian pizza earlier today. That shit good as fuck, man. Y'all yeah, might say Hawaiian pizza is nasty, like pineapple pizza is nasty, but fuck y'all have don't have the taste. Some of y'all don't have a single fucking clue what y'all talking about. Like pineapple on a pizza? Fuck y'all yeah, eat that shit. Dinner? <laughs> fuck yeah. Alright. There we go. So we just connected that little dingy right there. That little dinkly dink. So. First of all. I'm trying to figure out where this tiny screw goes. So let's use this. Uh, bam. So. This should give us a good idea of where shit should be connected. So. Right there, yep. Where I expected it to be, in the fucking place that looks like it doesn't need any support. So right here. So, the motherboard is in real nice. The D-pad feels good. I can, I can definitely see me playing like this. Even if it feels weird, it, it definitely could work. Like, it's not the best feeling D-pad in the world, but for, for, on a joystick, that feels really good. But I wouldn't, like, I don't know, since I guess I'm used to, like, interchangingly use the left and right even though the left and right holding it sideways is super fucking awkward so just now I slide in the the little pause the little minus button in here so that's gonna be all Gucci and nice so where is it here it is the boy the legend the myth we slide it in right there Now this part is super easy to slide in, but the issue is like putting it back like nice and tight. So now we have to put this in right there. And then we have to connect this to that thing right there. So connect that right there, close it. And everything should be nice and dandy. So, first of all, let's open this slot right here. Bam. So, yeah, little slightly dinky, and I'm like really nervous with this shit. There we go, so that should be nice and tight. Before I plug in all this screw in more stuff, 
I'm going to test this left joystick real quick. And let's leave that out as well. So. Oh, would you look at that? My fucking switch is dying. Great. Alright, so <laughs> we can't fucking test this motherfucker until like the very last stage, though. I'm not trying to be an asshole or anything. But like, just a mock-up of this just looks nice. the release button. Now, honestly, I would... I want to make a, a Joy-Con that doesn't have a battery in it because this... being at this light is just feels so fucking good. Like, it feels cheap, but like... the battery is as, as heavy as the Joy-Con without the battery itself. So... Let's keep going. Um, I didn't notice anything off about it. It felt very nice to control. It was not, it wasn't like annoying. So, alright, so the last thing I need to connect is this right here, which it does not look that hard to connect, but I might be mistaken. So, fucking. <laughs> If y'all honestly have the money to like buy like shit like this and not the money to uh, buy a Joy-Con, you shouldn't be trying to mod unless you're like an expert with electronics. Like, you should like, you should try to get into it without like being handhold. Like, just know, like, basic shit, like, hey, don't work on electronics that are still on and shit. Like, if you really want into getting, and this is not even, like, that much of a mod, like, this is just fine, like, pre-built shit and, like, putting it all nice and tight together and being smart about it. Because I'm pretty sure if you wanted something like this, it's going to cost you, like, to get it built from somebody else is going to cost you a lot, but I recommend everybody that has the time and patience to do it. Like, this is not for everybody, I understand that, but like, if you have the time and patience and you genuinely want, like, something to, like, represent you. Like, the basic wood Joy-Cons to me, like, it, it's so me. It's nice, it's basic, and I really fucking like it. I would never have this fucking glossy color on my Switch. But like, since my customer wants that, I'm gonna fucking do it. There. A little struggle, but not, not so much that. Fucking ass! I flipped it off. Get in there. Like, I don't understand. Okay, so this. Hook, and then we're on the final stretch, boys.
And from the looks of it, I haven't wasted a single, I haven't lost a single screw. So I say this is a pre, a pre success. Like I haven't even connected everything in it, and it's fucking successful. Definitely something I recommend everybody to try out at least once. Like, just replace one of your old Joy Cons with, like, or try to fix your old Joy Cons. Like, nothing fucking harms in, like, trying to fix something that's broke. Like, if you know it's something that's, like, super basic, like, oh shit, my Joy Cons, they don't connect at all. So, we gotta be careful with this battery. They're kind of fragile as fuck. Because they're not meant to be taken out. But bam, that was easy. And that looks like to be the end of it. Like, holy shit, training. And look at that. This feels nice. So, first of all. The whole white, black shit, I don't like it. Especially on the top, it doesn't look that good. Uh, I'm going to keep the black buttons because they came with like an extra set. So this is just the left Joy-Con. I'm going to do the right Joy-Con. And then connect it, pack it. I haven't even screwed it all in yet because I just want to test the the Joy-Con real quick so let's just give it a little snap BAM now I don't know why but this guy uh, he's about the same age as me and he's in a uh, he's in family mode so <clears throat> let's not even fucking So there's all the, mm-hmm, capture button. All right, let's test the joystick. Yeah, that feels really good. Uh, his calibration was a little off, so. And. There you go. This Joy-Con has, like, a similar texture to my Joy-Cons. It feels. It feels more glossy. Which. Definitely, you can tell by the cover itself is glossy. So scratch marks, scratch marks are gonna be more noticeable on this one. Oh, we gotta bring out the triangle thing. Mm -hmm. Now I know, and uh, like in the beginning of oh god, I just realized my thing is out of storage again. I know, like in the beginning, I said I was gonna fucking. Do the left joystick and then the right. But, God, fuck. Oh, stinky, uh oh, stinky, we're back. From the Clash of Clans, we're almost done with the left joystick. You just gotta fucking screw it in. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna do the, like I was saying earlier, I'm thinking I'm just gonna go right ahead and do 
the the switch itself which is gonna be dope as fuck because I never done the switch itself um, from what I understand it's not that hard it's uh it's kinda easy I'm I'm gonna do the the right joystick off camera because I'm running out of space and plus this is kinda like kinda unnecessary I, as a matter of fact, no, nah, I'll just probably stop doing the top camera because the top camera is like, is the, the one that's running out of storage. Uh, it's kind of dope working on this. And there we go. Nice red joystick. Um, this is the only thing I don't like about it. Um, should I have just left the gray one? I should have just left the gray one in there. It looks less noticeable, but too late. Too late, too lazy. You know? What's done is already done, so can't really change the past. Um, now I could say is that from the top view it looks decent except this right here I told the guy like hey they sell joysticks that are white he said he couldn't find it which is kinda like guy like and stop bullshitting me he also could have get this white but he didn't also these button right here which um, I'm probably gonna do my research see if I can fix it So we're going to turn this off real quick. Go ahead and turn this shit off. So we're going to be working on this motherfucker now. I never worked on a fucking screen, so this is very stressful. So we got this right here, which is pretty much the same shit as this. But... We got another fucking screwdriver. And look at that, we get a we get a secondary year warranty. Wow, would you look at that? Um I don't think the buttons came with the, the warranty, the white buttons. Now let's see. Hmm. Now I don't know if this guy didn't buy a bundle. Because that is different. That is definitely different. If you can't tell, this is like a slightly darker color. Like I honestly can't tell what this is. Like they probably spray paint this on because you got like weird textures inside. Every every shell that I bought from them they have like weird textures inside which I guess it's understandable so let's get this shit done so first of all I don't know what the fuck I'm doing uh, uh, what the fuck what the fuck what the fuck god damn so This guy's fucking legs are like deep in here. Like I have to pry them open. I guess this guy never used fucking dock, fucking whatever the fuck he called this. But dock mode? No, it wouldn't be dock mode. Okay, so this one we're working with a slightly small, uh, with the regular screwdriver so that's the diamond one so there's two at the bottom one right here we gotta be a little bit more careful with these screwdrivers these screwdrivers are tiny I'm telling you like they really shouldn't have done this but they did so I'm over here Mr. Modern Man so they have they have 
treating this switch like so trash. I'm sorry. Whoever I'm modding this for, I'm like, I'm feeling for, so bad. Uh, that piece just went to fucking oblivion. But I found it, luckily. So, that's all the... That's all the plus screws. Unless there's one in here. No, there isn't one in there. Oh man, that sucks. I just realized. This guy really didn't do his research. Like, like this looks like like one of those deviant art shit. I honestly, I, I, I'm not gonna judge. Like if it were for if it was for me, I would get like clear shells. And not even put the rainbow buttons. Like, that looks dope as fuck. Uh, I haven't seen any clear buttons, so I don't know if they have them. But, I do know... Is... This fucking screwdriver sucks ass. So, let's put that to the side. And grab these. Now all of these have extra screws and shit. I for one am not gonna touch the extra screws and shit. The only thing I will be touching is these lovely bits. Now, like I said earlier in this video, I genuinely don't want to use my own toolkit. Like I want to like show like you can go to this website. Uh, you can go to Amazon, buy this off from fucking Extreme Rates or whatever the fuck they're. You can get this off from Extreme Rates. Like, they're the only ones that I've seen. Like, they're pretty good. They're not, like, mind blowing, mind blowing or anything. It's just, like, their mods are pretty good. If this guy didn't get the bun. Either he got the bundle wrong, like. I imagine every spray paint uh, gloss is different. Like the wood texture is like, like clearly like they dipped it into like the wood texture or some shit. But like, I just don't understand. Like, bro, I'm about to whip on my fucking screwdriver so this shit doesn't work. Okay, so first of all, these screws are like dying. <laughs> like Nintendo really didn't want you to fucking screw these out. Like they're deep. They're really deep. Holy shit. That is longer than I expected to be honest. So... Holy fucking shit. So, this one is dead. So, those screwdrivers suck. Let's, let's bring out the big boy. Ah! The big boy. Itty bitty boys, big boys, it's good boys. Uh -huh. Here we go. All right, so I forgot which one it is, but pretty sure it's this one. If it ain't, well, fuck me. Oh my god, that feels so much better. Look at that. Would you look at that, guys? Fucking get your own screw case. Holy fucking shit. This is so much quicker. 
They're the proper size. They fucking work. So, I assume we have to take these out as well, which I'm kind of scared to do so. But with the magic of this fucking screw set, I can definitely do so. Like, these screw sets are like perfect for this kind of shit. So if anybody is wondering like what kind of toolkit this is, this is like a multi-purpose toolkit that I found. It's very good for like on the go shit if like... So the other, the last year I wanted to like upgrade the storage for my, for my computer. I upgraded the storage on my old laptop and my new laptop. Clearly I gave my new laptop like a bigger boost when it comes to storage and shit. Because I like recording a lot of shit. Um, once I get like a camera from my, my, my computer, that's definitely going to be noticeable. Um, and like this toolkit just makes everything so like easy to understand. I'm not trying to be like a smart ass and be like, haha, look at this. Uh, I'm literally just doing this because I'm kind of, kind of don't, oh, hold up. Can I just prop this open? Could I just prop this open the entire time? Uh, I'm assuming, yep, I could have. So I unscrewed all that for nothing, I guess. Great! <laughs> There's something holding it over there, so let's see if I can un tamper it over here, which I assume is a little harder. Actually, no, it's easier. So, definitely getting those vibes that I have to unscrew it. Oh, wait, is there something? In oh, would you look at that? I didn't even notice that. So let's remove this little SD card. Holy shit, this guy has 128 gigabytes. I am going to steal that, my guy. Never send your Switch to somebody like me with that. Holy fucking shit, guy. Somebody could have steal that shit so easily. Holy fucking shit, guy. That is like... Nintendo type shit right there. Okay, so I definitely have to unscrew... At least here. Like the middle one. From the looks of it, I definitely have to unscrew the middle one. But I might be wrong, and I might have to unscrew everything, which would highly suck. Nope, literally just the middle one. Okay. So, what do we got here? We got a really dirty switch. A really dirty switch. Nice little fan right here. And I'm assuming that's where the Switch game goes. And that's the SD card reader. So. Alright, so let me put this SD card right there. So let's do this. So. This right here has to go on screw. I'm literally just doing this like without watching a video. Like, so if I'm doing something that's like making you like cry or something, like 
feel free to leave a comment because I'm probably going to do this a little bit more often once I move. I'm really enjoying just like the whole taking something and ripping it apart. Holy shit, it's been like like a whole fucking day already. It's almost it's almost two o'clock. Which is fucking crazy to me, so So right away I notice it has uh vents, some foams, and this thing. This thing I'm just trying to remove like right now. Uh can I no, I'm going to have to remove that, and that is a fucking triangle. Why the fuck do you have one triangle in this? Alright. Ooh. 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 So, there you go. Nice. Plain. So, uh, there we go. Brain juice is flowing. Gamer moment going, guys. Holy shit, look at this. We're fucking getting somewhere. So that's that right there. Like, look how fucking easy this is. Instead of all that fucking cancer right there. That is fucking genuine ass cancer right there. Never fucking look in that direction. I, I'm going to fucking put this fucking screwdriver case. As a matter of fact, I'll, there's one just for the switch. If you really just want to mod the switch. Which is like really bad to start. I'm just gonna say, if you're gonna start modding mod like a PC, like try to get a laptop, upgrade the RAM or some shit because that's pretty fucking easy. Now, fucking be smart about it. Don't fucking try to upgrade the the RAM of like a. Ooh, that's dust. Ooh. That's where the air comes in, I guess. Don't try to upgrade the RAM of uh. <laughs> Of a goddamn Macintosh or whatever the fuck. You know, like a MacBook and shit. Okay, so we're trying to get this little thing right here peeled off and transport it to our little new little new cage. So I assume we can do this with a plastic thingy. Kinda. Not really. There we go, and then peel it off. And then look, that looks good. little leg thingy why the fuck are these legs so hard to remove like holy fucking shit like I haven't had my switch for that long but like holy fuck my switch ain't like that Just know that, like, this is really, really stressful. Like, I thought it would be calming. It's not calming. It's genuinely freak me out, but, like, there we go. Like, as, as each step I finish, the more comfortable I get, but then 
Once I look at this, this like freaks the fuck out of me. So that goes right there, but we still have this little piece right here. And you notice that I'm trying to like, I know this guy is probably not going to mod his switch again. At least he, sh he wouldn't want to because like, come on guy. So I'm just reusing like old this shell because this shell I'm probably going to throw away. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to reuse it or some shit. So let's put that right there. <clears throat> this one was a little fucked but like I said he shouldn't open it so he shouldn't notice anything there we go Rogers, and I have a kids party going on, and your buddy is invited. Come on, play with me. Play with me, Jimbo. Play with me. Play with me, Jimbo. Jimbo. This is getting like easy. Like this this part has been really easy. I thought the show was gonna be the hardest, but it's been pretty easy so far. Oh wait, that's the wrong screws. So first of all, let's do the bottom part because the bottom part looks like it's need the most love and affection. I know like this is off camera, but like I'm really getting nice and comfortable with the equipment. <laughs> as I say that, or as I fucking drop the thing. <sighs> Make sure you don't want to tighten the screws too hard. I noticed that a lot of people keep saying this shit. Kind of understand. Like, you don't want to fucking break the screw ports and shit. But yeah, this is mostly background footage if you really want to see like how long it would take like a fucking non-professional modder does his shit. Because I'm definitely not professional. I'm fucking getting, I'm paying, getting paid $25 for this shit. And the guy, the guy bought the equipment himself like this, all this, so... I don't know how much it cost him, but this is some shit that I do not do not want to see it in my fucking
This is like. I wish I could play like smooth jazz right now just to enjoy this moment. I'm like breathing into this fucking mask for so long it smells like shit. Man, it's getting super easy by the minute. There you go. So Half the console almost done. I just gotta screw the the bottom and top part and this part is almost done. I'm feeling very confident when it comes to this kind of shit. Like I, I'm pretty sure I'm like very nervous in the beginning and then now I'm just like less nervous, but I'm still nervous if you get with my drift. But like, this is truly just like a thing you just want to go through, like the emotions and shit. Like, I'm getting paid to do this. And I'm probably ask for a tip or some shit. Like, this is annoying. I just recently moved to this fucking room as well. Luckily, this room had this nice light. Um, fucking. I'm like surprised that we had to move. And then we're gonna move again around February. Like late February, we're gonna have to move again. That's why I haven't been uploading anything because I've been like. I've been trying to like relax. Try study, graduate, then we're gonna move, and then all that shit. So, alright, I'm literally just gonna give him all these fucking screwdrivers. Because these screwdrivers are so fucking bad. So, let's put all the screwdrivers in this bag right here. For this guy. Like, I, I was literally just gonna be like, oh yeah. Keep running with the screwdriver guy. Believe it or not, it's possible to build this shit with these screwdrivers, but I still recommend you buy screwdrivers. Like, these screwdrivers are literally just there for the people that are broke as fuck and can't afford screwdrivers. Which is very, like, Extreme Rate is, like, very generous for doing this shit. Like, like if it was for me, I would have been like, haha, fucking buy your own screwdriver set because... I'm not gonna eat. I wish there was like a, like a setting where you could turn that off and just buy the buttons and shit. Because I imagine this costs a lot to make. 
Not as much as the Joy-Con custom parts because, like, that shit is still, like, brand new, but fuck, man. Now for the dreaded right Joy-Con. If it was for me, I would have just turned it in like this to him. Be like, here you go. This is this is your switch. This is your little thingy. But I'm a good battle. I'm a good guy. I still don't like this. But yeah, this looks good. So let's let's get straight to this one. Uh, I really want to play some music, so let's listen to my mix, and... screws and shit and then we're done uh, there was like a little bump that I had to fix figured out how to fix that pretty easily um, I tested all the inputs already and this shit looks in pretty slick um, honestly like I said a million times and I'm gonna keep saying it it's not my kind of taste the whole gloss shit is really annoying this matted shit um, I'll leave some links for uh, the website that the uh, they can get shells like these. These shells are pretty fucking good. So here it is. Looks fucking pretty dope, honestly. Like I said, fixes right here and there. But like this is how the guy wanted it. So the back looks vintage as fuck. Like. I just imagine like getting sandpaper, scraping all of this, and then putting like black paint, tapping it with a paper towel, and making this look old as fuck, like very vintage. I can definitely see this like looking like really grungy. But overall, this shit fucking feels great. It, yeah, that feels fucking. And like the texture is like, it's different from a Joy-Con. The Joy-Con is like. Not as slippy as this. This feels smooth. But yeah, this is this is this actually went better than I thought. I didn't break anything. This took me about like I I guess three hours and it looks good. For like for the equipment that I got, it looks fucking great. I didn't fuck it up. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this in and I'm gonna go ask him some questions and shit. See what the fuck this guy have to say about his switch. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy that. I'm gonna ask him about that fucking parent thing, that's weird.
I still like this look, honestly. Like, just the feel of this is so... It's It feels so fucking bad, what it looks... Vintage as fuck. I, I, like, I like the look of it more than the feel. But this feels nicer. The texture of this feels nicer than this. This feels... Rougher, I guess. That's the best way I can describe it, but overall... Leave what, leave your thoughts. What do you think? Huh?